Hello everyone, welcome to Geeker Mag. Microsoft recently rolled out Windows 11 24H2 update, packed with exciting new features. If your device meets minimum requirements, you can simply download and install it from Windows Update settings. But if you are using unsupported hardware, you might encounter two issues. The update doesn't appear in the Windows Update. And if you try to update using Windows 11 24H2 ISO, it shows a message saying this PC doesn't meet the system requirements. If this sounds like your situation, don't worry, in this video, I will show you a quick hack to upgrade your unsupported PC to Windows 11 24 H2 using the ISO image. Before that, I'm trying to get 20,000 subscribers on YouTube. Please consider subscribing to the channel as this encourages me in creating more similar videos. If you have already downloaded the Windows 11 24 H2 ISO, it's great. If not, check out my video linked in the description for detailed step. So let's get started. Double click the downloaded Windows 11 24 H2 ISO to mount it. This creates a virtual drive in File Explorer. Open the mounted drive and copy all the files. Now go to C drive or primary installation drive, create a new folder name, something like Windows 11. Paste all the copied ISO files in this folder. Now open command prompt as administrator, for that click on the search icon and type cmd. When it appears in the search results, click run as administrator. When USC dialog box appear, click yes to continue. In the command prompt window, you need to type these commands one by one. cd space backslash hit enter. Next cd space windows 11 backslash sources and hit enter make sure to replace windows 11 with your folder name if it's different next you need to type setup prep.exe space forward slash product space server and hit enter the setup will begin and you will see a window mentioning Windows Server. Don't worry, this will automatically install the correct edition of Windows 11. Click the link that says change how setup downloads updates and select not right now. This skips update checks since the ISO already include the latest version. Continue through the setup, you will notice it bypasses the system requirement checks. On the choose what to keep screen, select key files, settings and apps. If this option is grayed out, make sure ISO language matches your current system language. For example, if your system is in English US, then ISO must be English US. The upgrade process will now begin. This will take 30 to 40 minutes depending on your PC. Your system will reboot several times during this process. Once upgrade completes, log into your PC. Head over to About Your PC section in Settings, and you will notice that you have successfully upgraded to Windows 11 24 H2. Finally, go to C Drive and delete the folder you created earlier to free up storage space. And that's it. I hope this helps. Why don't you give it a try? If you have any question, let me know in the comments. And if you find this video useful, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel to get notifications about more similar videos. Thanks for watching.